Judge Heath has completed his placings in the Melking Shorthorn Senior Two-Year-Old Cow Class. Will the junior exhibitors please take a step forward? The second place junior is entry 1497, Teen Nitro Athena, shown by Alex Teen of Watertown, South Dakota. And the first place junior is 1494, Innisfail Psy Constance 215, shown by Kyla Jarvis of BDF Farms, Cory, Indiana. In third place is entry 1512, Elron Megadeth Waveland EXPET, shown by Haley Grunwald of Lost Nation, Iowa. In second place was entry 1513, Elron Megadeth Wrigley EXP, shown by Haley Grunwald of Lost Nation, Iowa. Winning the class Best Bread and Owned and Best Utter is entry 1504, Core Star Lovely Lady EXP ET, shown by Corey Salzal of Litchfield, Minnesota. Congratulations, and now to our judge with his reasons. All right. To start it off, what an incredible class of senior two-year-olds. The depth is really deep in this class, and it's really, uh, it's really smoking hot at the top, uh, especially these first three. Uh, the first young cow, um, I'm making her best udder today, and the reason why I'm making her best udder, she's longer and smoother and sweeter in that four udder attachment. I like the size and the shape of her front teeth and the way it's underneath the udder, not nicer than the cow in second. I also prefer their overall length and stretch to her frame, her openness and slant and drop to her rib, especially that rear flank today. I also prefer the cleanliness of bone in that hock area than the cow in second. The cow in second you really admire, maybe a little ni nicer at the top of the rear udder today and a little stronger, a little more front end. Second cow over the third cow on that front end, she has more lift to that that shine she has more uh, fullness through that crop a cow's uh, harder in the back part of that loin and shows more length and stretch to her frame today third cow fits in very nicely to that pattern uh, you really admire for a square cut her high tight udder and her big ribs she places over the cow in fourth in her overall length and stretch to her frame her height and tidiness to her mammary system the way she moves on her hind feet and legs uh, from the side she's stronger in that passion area than the cow in fourth cow in fourth over the cow of fifth she just more closely follows that pattern in her overall balance and style she's neater in that tail head placement she's cleaner and sharper and more open all the way through and has more quality to that rear udder and definition through the crease the big fifth the big strong powerful cow in fifth places over the cow in sixth today on her overall width she's wider through that chest she has more bloom through that rear udder more height and width of that uh, rear udder today the cow coming out in six a very nicely balanced cow, a cow that's very sweet and correct, but a cow that just doesn't quite have enough milk today, a cow that maybe has a nice future in later years. Thank you very much.